Let right, me right. let me get my whole speech out because you know I don't do this. Okay. Yeah, I do. It's me. Look at my car. Look at my life. I do way too much. Okay. <laughs> so anyway, Carisha. Um. And JT told me she like Uzi. You ain't gonna do nothing but make it worse. So don't say nothing. But you know, clearly I run this shit, and this is mine. Every mine. So it's just like. Carisha, oh, shut up. Uh, JT, 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 JT. If I tell you, if I told you tongue kiss me on this live right now, you're going to do it. Okay, well, just say So just say chill. Like, hey. <laughs> you saw what I said to you, Carisha, because you left me on scene. Yeah, because it's like, it's understood. I don't, you, you're right, not I'm friends, and we don't have to be friends that scene. It's you, not about that, Carisha. You already, I told you, you know I ain't going to say it on live. I already told you what be wrong with me. Everybody know what be wrong with me. You don't know me like that. Yeah, so but exactly. I I never did nothing to you. This your second No, you didn't know. You see what I said. You, see, this you, your saw, the, second you saw what time. I said. So oh, at well. this point, at this point, it's just and like, it's my okay. last, and, and look, and it's my last time, like whether you like it or not, it's my last time. I would never do you like that. I never, ever do you like that. That's not even in me. Like, I won't do you like that. What you do to me? Like, what you did to me? Honestly, tell me what you did to me. All right, me. baby, I see what you want. Relax. Like, what, what you want. Like, I'm not on a weirdo shit. What you did to me? No, I'm just saying, like, you, you up there. Yeah, I am. I am up yeah, there, but I'm, I'm not going to be, I'm not going to go there. You're taking too long with my phone. I'm a, you're not getting on live anyway. That's number one. Okay, so Uzi, you could just hang up and we'll talk off the line because it's a lot. Yeah, because he gonna. No, talk I ain't gonna, I'm not gonna say nothing. I'm just saying you get what I'm saying. You talk yeah, to I get what you're saying. I get All right, what you're I'll saying. talk to you later. I'll talk to you later. Okay. All right. Get off live. All right, Felicia. So <laughs> I can't even. Summer. Come on. Let me see Summer. JT. What's up? You look real pretty. Thank you. You ain't showing your shirt? Let me see your shirt. What you got on, Rick Owens? Yeah, Rick Owens got whole clothes, girl. <laughs> I got on Rick Owens. Hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on. Okay, okay, they need a sponsor, you sis. Oh, I, I see nipples. <laughs> <laughs> I got on. All right, that's enough, that's enough, that's enough. Uzi for real. Come on, no, I ain't gonna lie. Right. Right. Don't get like that. Don't, don't make me get like, like that. Okay, you okay. Don't. It's a 10. We both gonna take it to we're a five. We're gonna take it to a five and we really Yeah, need... we both gonna take it, but we're gonna But when we, we go we... to the room, but when we go to the room, can we take it to a eleven? We can take it to twelve when we get off live. Should I take it to a twenty? Okay, y'all say so y'all can just call me back. All right. I'm gonna call we'll call back. All right, love you twin. All right, bye Carisha. We love you. Bye bye. We... Bye. Yeah. Wait, yeah, Andy. I don't uh, know how you get off. <laughs> <laughs> hey, Uzi, don't don't address none of my bitch, my nigga. You 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 handle your bitch, nigga. You stay on your side. Time to say something. You ain't got one more time to say none of my bitch, nigga. I promise you, I'ma punch your teeth out your mouth. Don't say nothing else, nigga. Nothing else to my bitch, nigga. If you don't like my bitch, don't like my bitch. Let them do them. I don't get in they shit. We don't get in they problems, nigga. Stay the little weirdo you is, nigga. Keep rocking purses. Keep doing that bitch shit you doing. I ain't with none of that plan, bro. None of that. None of that plan. I'm the same nigga that saved you from getting robbed from offsetting them, nigga. Don't forget that. I'm the same nigga. I was the only nigga in the studio that had blicks on me, nigga. I'm the same nigga that kept you from getting your jury took when Merch picking up your jury, nigga. Let's not play stupid, my nigga. Stop playing dumb with me, nigga. Don't play stupid at all, bro. Don't play dumb. You feel me? Go on on with that shit, bro. Deal with your bitch. Fuck with your bitch, nigga. And stay with your bitch. That's all I'm going to say. One time I will slap dog shit out you. I could have slapped dog shit out you at the party the other day. You feel me? You and that motherfucker with security. I don't ride around Miami with security. We ride around Miami with sticks, nigga. That's it. That's how we play. I'm tired of you bitch ass niggas going on this bitch acting like you niggas is tough and you niggas is gangster. You niggas hide up on the niggas from Atlanta, go around niggas in Atlanta, pay niggas, give niggas whatever the fuck they want just so niggas can be around you. I ain't got to do none of that, nigga. I'm really thugging, nigga. Stop playing with me, nigga. Don't say nothing else to my bitch, nigga. That's my last time saying this shit, nigga. I'm telling you. Or you're gonna have a real problem on your hands. Herb can't save you. Mansky can't save you. Watt can't save you. Nobody can't save you. I want my head up, nigga. I want my fade, nigga. You want the box Richard Kid so bad? Come box me, you bitch ass nigga. Let's check it out and check it out now. The short nigga syndrome is indeed real people. Okay? From Tory Lanez to Uzi, you always got a short nigga who, to keep it real, got the biggest temper. Got the biggest attitude and always want to put hands on somebody and is super aggressive. Now, usually them short niggas can't really handle their liquor. You give them two cups of handy, they are drunk out of their mind and they're ready to be at the fisticuffs. Now, Uzi, 
who allegedly was drinking. That's what we found out in a couple tweet and deletes later by JT. Uzi dates JT, okay? JT's one half of the City Girls. The other half of the City Girls is Young Miami. She dates somebody in the industry called Southside. Now, Southside is the founder of 808 Mafia. If you don't know, Uzi's biggest song, The All My Friends Are Dead, okay? Uh, EXO Tour Life is produced by a member of uh, uh, 808 Mafia, which is TM88. So pretty much they're kind of all linked in, okay? However, Uzi pretty much hijacks the phone from his girl to tell Carisha, a.k.a. Young Miami, it's going to be the last time he going to repeat what he got to say. And he had to make sure he also told her how lit his life was, okay? The cars and all the other stuff that he was doing. Now, obviously, uh, Carisha looked like she wanted to say, nigga, get the fuck off the live, but she was shook and Uzi was on 10. Also, Uzi pointed out to his own girl, you going to do what the fuck I want you to do if I tell you, Kiss me, you gonna kiss me if I say you're not going on live. And by the way, he talked to her like she was a goddamn kid. He said, that's enough live for you. If I say it, you can't do it, okay? By the way, keep in mind, Uzi's a really lit rap star. The City Girls, like, I, they got a lot of movements on social media, but in music and how their music performs, they're nowhere close to Uzi. Now, that's where Southside jumps in. And he doesn't like the fact that Uzi was talking to his girl that way. So basically, he said he's going to knock the shit out of Uzi and reminded Uzi that without him, Offset would have robbed him and beat him up. And also, he would have got his chain taken at some other occasion. Now, let me give you the history on Southside. For whatever reason, Southside is the guy who's always getting caught with guns here or there. And also, infamously, when uh, uh, Soldier Boy was trying to pick on somebody or somebody was getting picked on, he's always quick to brandish the Call of Duty artillery that he got. Okay, for what some people say, they say Southside is one of the guys not pretending to be gangster. He's actually about that shit. Okay, now, what Southside is saying is that Uzi's one of these popular rap guys who pretty much start talking a lot of smack because they're rich and famous, but they move around with security so they feel tough. And he wants that to stop, especially when that's happening to his girl, because dudes like Uzi ain't really gangster. OK, now Uzi did get on Instagram, uh, Twitter actually afterwards and said, yo, you know, he was playing around. He said he can't do it on the right. And basically he said that, yo, it wasn't that big of a deal. He didn't address Southside. However, he's basically saying that the energy towards Carisha wasn't meant to be aggressive or nothing like that. However, it does look like Southside still wants to fade. He said the same fade he wanted to give Rich the Kid. Let's do that. So I don't know what y'all think, but I think Uzi, if he was really playing around, should probably hit this dude up privately. By the way, you can't blame Southside because the girl, Carisha, a.k.a. Young Miami, told Uzi, like, hey, let's just get off and talk about this privately. Uzi wanted to talk about it on an Instagram live in front of 60,000 people. And because of that, yes, you're going to get her man to now address you publicly rather than hit your phone privately. So what do you guys think about this, man? Do you think this is just another case of, like, you know, the short niggas just getting out of hand again? Or do you think Uzi got a right to be talking and popping his shit like how he is based on the fact that it's Uzi, okay? You guys get in the comments. Make sure you guys like and subscribe to Bullshit Academics. I'm out.